Sound K. In Sonic Perry's book, The Little Prince, it says that it is a miracle when someone we like likes us back. You might think that only applies to romance, but it actually applies to all of our relationships. All around us, we have friends and family that we love, and they love us back. We rarely recognize it, but every day we are living in our own little miracles. Welcome to Sound K, and I'm your DJ. Stephanie, or at the same time, you know, for the tragic news that word we say, you know, that was a miracle if that was, you know, the happy news, or if it was just tragic news, we say, you know, miracle didn't happen. So it has two, you know, faces. I think. Well, I do believe in miracles, though, and I hope we all have only happy miracles from now on. Well, anyways, back to the point. I love the line that I shared with you for the intro. All around us, we have friends and family that we love, and they love us back. So it's like a feedback, right? Well, hmm, it is a give and take, and just like me and our listeners, don't you think? I love you all, and I can feel that you love me back. Yes, and you guys always cheer me up, and I seriously was not myself. Yesterday, to be honest, because my friend Joanne, she she passed away、uh, last night, and you know, if I didn't have our listeners to support, I don't know. I don't even want to think about that. And、uh, I wanted to thank our listeners once more for making me stronger. Because again, this entertainment world, this entertainment business, it really it kind of scared me, because I have to, you know. A host a show while that tragic happened to my friend, and I have to, you know, host a show and being responsible,、uh, re- responsible, sorry, and without showing the emotional, you know, personal emotion, emotional feelings. So, but you know what? I was able to go through because of our listeners' love, and I am not even joking. And once more, thank you so so much. Whoever you know supported me and then send in you know the condolences and supportive message. Thank you once more. So you know what today let's do something special. Tell me what you love about me. Tell me what you love. No, just kidding. Tell me what you love about me. And when I read the message, I will give you the feedbacks. I will tell you what I love about you. All right, personally. So please send in your messages on our message board, or you can send in hello plus what's up message. Where in the world are you listening to Sound K? Which country? Where in that country? It is eight o seven in Korea right now. What time is it? Where you are? What are your plans for the day? Tell me all about it. Tell me your right now. What are you doing? So please post it on our message board. We'll share it all together. So now、uh, let me tell you how you can join us on Sound K. If you are on Jeju-do Island, our FM frequencies are eighty point seven in Jeju City. 80.1 in Sogipo City, 101.9 megahertz in Daejeon area, which is in the Jeju Global Education City, and you can also find us on T D M B I D Dang Radio. If you have a smartphone, you can listen to our、uh, show by downloading the Adi Dang Radio application that is available for both iPhone and, of course, Android operation systems. And be sure to check us out on Twitter and Facebook. Twitter ID is at Sound K two O two two, and Facebook. Facebook is soundk dot arirang radio, and also feel free to send us your comments, messages, questions on our website. It is www dot arirang radio dot com slash soundk. Let's listen to one more track and come back. This is Kijo Eternity by Vex. <laughs> quiz, quiz, quiz. Okay, so are you guys ready for tonight's daily quiz? Here is the question. So listen very, very carefully. 
Musician Yun Sang will be doing a surprise collaboration with a member of an idol group. The two artists will be performing together on the song "Naege to You" on part one of Yun Sang's new EP, "The Duets." And fans are eager to see how the duet will turn out, since they are so different in terms of experience. The two got to know each other when Yun Sang produced the debut album from the girl group Lovelies. Who are in the same entertainment agency as this artist? Their collaboration will be released on December fifth, and this K-pop star is the leader of the group Infinite. So there you go, leader of the group Infinite. As a solo artist, he's released the song "60Chuo Sixty Seconds." So who? Is it this member of Infinite who collaborated with Yun Sang? Number one, Taemin. Number two, Rap Monster. Number three, Songgyu. Once more, number one, Taemin. Number two, Rap Monster. Number three, Songgyu. So now accept only the answers written on our message board. So log on to our website www.arirangradio.com/soundk and leave us your answers. Of course, we'll announce the winners on our message board. So be sure to check that out. If you get the answer right, we will be giving away the signed CD of Nicole. It is Nicole's amazing signed CD. So be sure to leave us your answers on our message board. Once again, it's arirangradio.com/soundk. Okay, so we have、uh, one message from Scarlett Chang from Tunisia saying hello, Oni. Hello, Stephanie. I am a new listener and I love you already. Okay, so. I love you too, and welcome to Sound K Family. I really appreciate that、uh, you wrote a message for me. I'm already loving you because thank you very much for supporting our show. Because this one, you know, message、uh, really cheers everyone up. And thank you very much for sharing. And once more, welcome to Sound K Family. And we have a feedback message for the intro question. Divi Squana ninety one from Romania. So, what I love about you? You have a warm and calming voice, and I appreciate that you always have a smile on your face, even when you have problems. Well, that's my job. Thank you very much for sharing that, and I wish I could be as positive as you are. Okay, so what I love about you,、uh, Simeon Oana Dibisquana, you always you're very bold, and you always、uh, share your stories. You are not afraid afraid to share your you know problems and concerns, and I really appreciate that. I know you are our、uh, loyal listeners, and you always say hello. You always send hello messages, and also for the segment corners. And I don't think that you are a greedy person because you always like very loyal to all this segment corner. So that's the thing that I really love about you, DB Squana ninety one from Romania. And I really appreciate that. And once more, thank you very much for your feedback message. Yes,、yeah, so、once more, I want to repeat、um, that about the intro question. It's not actually a question. It's like a feedback、uh, and give and take messages that we are going to do, just like what I. And uh, uh, Scarlett and Simeon did. So,、uh, tell me what you guys love about me, and I will tell you. Give a feedback message when I listen, when I'm reading. Sorry, when I read your message, and I will give you guys a feedback and tell you what I love about you. All right. So please send in your messages, and while you guys participate for the daily quiz answers, also because we have fantastic prize. It is a Nicole's signed CD. We are going to take a music break and come back. The first song that we are going to listen to is "Love Christmas" by Chrome Family, and followed by "Clockwork" by Untouchable featuring Baby On. Welcome back, everyone. You're listening to Sound K, and I'm your DJ Stephanie. Guess what? You guys are you guys are making me so so happy.、Um, thank you very much for sending in about what you love about me. Okay, so let's share more messages. We have Marcus from the state. Love about you, Stephanie. Love your energy, Stephanie. And as a fan, the outside looking in, I think you have a beautiful spirit and plus the aura about you. Marcus, the thing that I love about you is you have my 
musical photo <laughs> framed. You have that frame also. It's a very special, one and only in the whole world. And and also you are very, uh, you're very into this, you know, K-pop industry, like entertainment world. I was surprised that when you said, you know, Kim ki um who's the movie director and you're naming all the famous movie director that I did, wasn't even not familiar with but I'm sure that you are a big fan of you know film and also maybe sometimes you know better than me and I think you're a very smart guy and also have a warm you know you have big big heart Marcus from the States, thank you very, very much for your feedback message. And we have 80s from Iceland saying, Miracle plus what I love about DJ. <laughs> so a miracle happened to me this year. And my favorite singer and role model is reading this message right now. <laughs> thank you very much for saying that. One of the many things I love about Stephanie is how honest she is. And you never go around the topic. You address it with care and revolve. And what style? Oh, what style? I like that. You share parts of your personal life, maybe sometimes too much, <laughs> with us, and it makes us feel so much closer to you. DJ Stephanie Chang. Yes, 80s. I am speechless um, because 80s, everyone knows that you are the lawyer, lawyer, no, loyal listener. Uh, for our show and not only sound k i know you are very active in um different uh, radio show also but you know what i love you and whenever i don't see your name uh when i start my show i get kind of i kind of freak out it's i'm like where's 80s seriously and not only on the show you communicate with me uh, on sns too and that's really important and that means more to me because uh, you know, sometimes whenever I can share uh, things on the show, we share it on SNS and you definitely share your, you know, pictures and photos and I see everything. I saw you dancing, you know, you're a great belly dancer and the whole, the picture, because I've never been to Iceland and I think it's a great to see the whole atmosphere and I am really, really glad that I have friend and 80s. Thank you very, very much for supporting me and our show, of course. Thank you once again. And we have Christina, same 24 from Indonesia. What I love about DJ Stephanie. Good evening, DJ Stephanie. Listening to your voice and somehow gives me energy. Really? Well, it's a win-win situation because whenever I see our listeners and especially the messages that I receive, you guys really cheer me up and gives me energy. Otherwise, I cannot host a show. This is nothing. It, our show is going to be so bored, oh my goodness, without your messages. So, Christina, as always, thank you very much for your message. And thank you for sharing your um, concern uh, last time Yeah, with your uh, for the segment corner. So, thank you very much. Same 24 from Indonesia. And we have half 2014 from the States. What I love about DJ Stephanie. So first of all, I am so sorry to hear that the news, my condolences are with you. Thank you. Yes. And what I love about you is first sharing your experiences together and cheering each other when having hard times or if we are sick. Yes, I don't like any kind of, you know, negativity, seriously. And secondly, and you are such a sweet person, you give us listeners so much strength and support. Just by tuning in, my whole day can change knowing others are going through or have gone through similar situations as me. So never lose your smile. <laughs> Yes, and you have a, such a beautiful smile and always think positive. Yes, love you, Stephanie. And I love you, Heather, because you are very active when we have a star date. And you know what? Sometimes when we don't get, you know, receive the enough message for, you know, this artist when we bring inside of studio, I, it's nerve wracking because I want to ask a lot of things. But whenever I cannot come up with my own, you know, question, then I need our listeners help. Right. And plus, I love to share my, you know, life experiences, because as long as I can help you guys, then I think the whole, you know, situation and the, the atmosphere we can go through. 
even you know from the hardship we can go through together. So definitely it's a win-win situation. I know I sometimes get a little personal and get emotional, but you know what? That's my concept. It's not. A, it's not even a concept. It's like natural thing. So I just go with the you know the atmosphere, and just go with my you know own true heart like feelings and i think it's really really important and i'm sh- i'm really glad that our listeners understand that so thank you very very much for sharing your message who we have a lot to share but time is running we have to listen to one more track and come back this is shiganga nagya time and funny leaves by acto musician welcome It's time for sound K. Yeah. All right, what's good, Stephanie? Take it over. Thank you for tuning in. You're listening to Sound K, and I'm your DJ Stephanie. So on part two, seems like a lot of our listeners are very excited to see our. Amazing artists. Yes, it is Big Flow. Big Flow. They are going to join us for part two for start date. So make sure to send in your questions. And on December eighth, that's on Monday, we are going to invite Lovelies in our studio. And also on Thursday, they are back with this amazing song. What's up? They are going to join us in our studio. So make sure to support our guests with a lot of love and messages plus the questions. On our message board, and we need more messages for Tuesdays and Wednesdays and Sundays. Hook me corner. On Tuesday, we have Tell Me Tell Me with Corey from Two Four K, where we give you the advice. You can just share anything. And on Wednesdays, we are talking. We are going to talk about love. We have Heart to Heart with Jesse. And Benji in our studio, where we accept your messages about romance. So if you have any question for relationship about relationship and love, then send in your curiosity or problems or concerns on our message board. And then on Sundays, we let you become the DJ of the night with my playlist. So please leave us the theme with three songs you like to listen. Okay, so tell us a little bit about、uh, the song or the explanation or why you choose that song. Okay, sound K is made complete with all of your support. Please keep those messages coming on our message board. Once again, it's arirangradio.com/soundk. Let's move on to our blah 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 message time. Your everyday thoughts turn into a great line on the radio with blah blah blah. Listen to today's topic and tell us what it means to you. Okay, so today's topic is what's your motto of life? Yes, let's share motto. Yes, what is your motto of life? Please send in your feedback messages with the title blah blah blah. My motto is tomorrow is another day. I think I share this right. Every time, whenever it comes to moto, yes, moto section, yes,、um, yes. Tomorrow is another day because I really, you know, put a lot of efforts, and now is the most important, you know, time for me. I don't really get you know clinging on the past. I just move on. Yes,、uh, and、uh, I think it's really, really important to see. Forward, not backwards, right? So my motto of life is tomorrow is another day. Yes. So how about yours? Please share your mottos on our message board with the title blah blah blah. Okay, so let's move on to Aki from the from the Philippines. Is Philippines okay? Because I heard that the typhoon is gonna hit, you know, soon. Scary. I think we shared that yesterday from Ronald, right? But、uh, we, I prayed for you guys, and I'm still praying. So hopefully, you guys are okay. Hello, DJ Stephanie. It's been too long since I last listened to your show. Was、well, since I worked in the graveyard shift, and tonight is my off. I see. Thank you very much for tuning in. And you've mentioned about friends. I know it's hard to keep a smile and to keep pro- professional given the situation. Yes, I know your friend is in the safe place now. Yes, rest in peace. And what I love about you is that, well, other than your graceful dancing, you also have ability to bring smiles to your fan. 
Woohoo! And we love you and always will support you. Thank you for your time reading. Of course, Aki from the Philippines. You know what? Um, Aki, you also contact me on SNS. And thank you very much for sharing your um, a message with me. And plus, I know, uh, I know your, you know, a profile picture. Yes, I think you're beautiful. And it's okay. You're busy. And if you cannot tune in, then that's fine. But thank you very much for your message. And that's why I love about you. Whenever you are available, then you send in a message. And I am really happy about that. Thank you, Aki from the Philippines. And we have Asia96 from Bulgaria. Well, hello. Lovely DJ and Sound K staff and the listeners, oh, you are very much welcome. Okay, and we are one family, right? Yes, of course. Today is it was a busy day for me. The school, it was a mess. <laughs> Sorry to hear that. And exams and preparation about our prom. Prom. Wow, that's exciting. The problem about our prom is now is that we choose after the party to go somewhere abroad, and now all kind of problems comes up. And but everything will pass, and it will be absolutely amazing. I know it will be definitely. And intro, uh, Oni, to me, you are like a real sister. And actually, your voice is so soft, and I love listening to it. And I feel so so good every time when I talk with you, talk to you, and I think that you communicate with us. I am so thankful, Ani, and you already know me so well. And you are an amazing person, and I kind of feel still like a new listener. You're not new anymore. No, 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 no. And but looks like I'm getting closer and closer to you and Sound K as a Sound K family. Love you, Ani, and Sound K. Okay, the thing that I love. About you, I, f- me, definitely feel that you are my little sister. Seriously, Asia, because um, you have a brother who's very, very protective of you, right? And you share your problems with us. And I know there's a things going on with your, you know, the certain a、uh, situation, but somehow you overcome. And always, whenever I see your message, you're very cheerful. So I know you're young. But you are very, very mature. You're mature enough to share your thoughts, and actually, sometimes I learn from your f- from your message. Actually, I'm being honest. And Asia, as always, I just love, love, love whenever you support our show. Seriously, literally every single day you send in your message, and thank you very much for doing that. So whoever send in the you know hello message or little greeting, even that little greeting really makes me、um, feel like we are we are family. So thank you very much, Asia, once more from Bulgaria. But you know what? It is our time to listen to one more track and come back. This is "Real Let Go" by Taekwong Nama, the boss. Yes, welcome back, everyone. That was "Moon River" by Nam Yuri. Definitely is a very romantic song. I think it's perfect for this、uh, winter. Okay, um, because we're running out of time, I'm going to share more messages instead of of going back, uh, recap our. A daily quiz. Okay, we have a Scarlett John once more from Tunisia for the what's up message today. I didn't go to university, and I am planning on spending the day in my room watching K dramas and listening to Arirang Radio. <laughs> Thank you very much. Well, I'm you know glad that you can have your relaxing time. Yes. Thank you very much. And we have Valentina from Romania. So hello, hello, DJ Stephanie. What I love about you is that you don't sound boring. Oh, thank you very much. And your voice is so refreshing, and you are so so cute. So I totally agree with Divis Kuana. Yes, Simiano Ana, and you always smile. And this is the best thing when you、uh, suffer. Thank you. Yes. Um. So whenever I go through the hardship, I'm a human being. You know, I. Go through the hardship and variety things, you know. Even there's the negative thing, doesn't really matter. But whenever, as soon as I come into studio,、uh, it I'm not even joking, but、uh, it really, really、um, brings that different side of me. 
and your message and sharing that kind of I can forget about that worries and concerns. And whenever I share and try to give you guys the advice for the segment corners, then I feel much, much happier. I become I feel very happy when I can help others. I seriously I'm being totally dead honest about this but so i can really like focus on other things i have to work whenever i go through through the hardship otherwise i don't know how i can survive from that but anyways valentina i love about you because you always support yes um the daily you know the quiz answers and also for your the messages and thank you very much and i see your name often especially for the star date question message so thank you very much valentina once more from romania and we have kiss for q from the state so message to you dj stephanie i love your voice and your sweet attitude uh in the u.s uh it's early here but every time i tune into sound k and just listening listening excuse me to your voice makes me calm really also because i admire that you can do what you do every day i am sorry for your lost yeah lost of my friend and i applaud uh, so you, you for being able to be here for us. Yes, of course. And I want to thank you for still being here. And I have so much school stress. And recently, my niece passed away. Oh, my goodness. I'm so sorry to hear that. And listening to you is like a way to make me relax and be happy throughout the day. That's what I love about you. I love you because you share your stories. And even now, um, I am so sorry once more about your niece. Because losing the family member, losing the friend is the same thing. But losing the family member, oh my goodness. I cannot really imagine i really hate to um but kiss for q actually ka from the state thank you very much for your sweet sweet uh, letter well yes a message because i am glad that my voice can calm you down and it can be a little sensitive because you're tuned in in the morning and people are sensitive. I'm sensitive in the morning because I get really lazy. So, <laughs> but you know what? Um, thank you very much say, for saying that. And I just love this whole great uh, greeting plus the message and the story that you share. It's a win-win situation. You definitely made me smile. Oh my goodness. I guess uh, what you guys, because we are running out of time. I don't think I can go over the messages, but we have a one on a blah 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 feedback message from 80s uh we have my motto is god doesn't send you a mission if he thinks you won't get through it stronger no matter how hard this thing gets you are strong enough to endure it thank you very much 80s for sharing your motto so the messages that i couldn't go through don't worry i will go i will read your message during the weekend so don't worry about that so thank you very much once again for supporting part one but I will see you guys on part two with Big Blow in our studio. The last song that we're going to listen to is Happy Together by Park Yushin and see you guys on part two. Yes, yes, yes. Welcome back, everyone. The second part of Sound K has started. It is Thursday, December 4th, 2014. And you can enjoy your morning, afternoon, or evening with me on Sound K. And for start date, kicking off the second part of tonight's show, of course, we are going to bring Big Flo in our studio. But before we start our interview, since we couldn't go through the blah, blah message at all, I'm going to share a little bit more. We have Nika from Russian Federation saying my motto every decision you make always follows responsibility please don't regret wow amazing thank you very much and we have marcus once more from the state saying my motto for right now is similar to yours stephanie my motto is a day at a time yes 
absolutely a day at a time. Uh, and another times in life, you just gotta take things a day at the time. Yes, Marcus from the states. Thank you very much. And we have a very good one, Asia ninety six from Bulgaria saying, "To me, my motto is never give up." Yes, never give up. Thank you very much for sharing this cheerful, cheerful messages.、Uh, let's listen to our track and bring Big Flow into our studio. This is "Yappa Jatta," beautiful by Park Boram featuring Zico. Star date. It is our time to go on a date with the famous, the hottest, the most popular K-pop stars right here on Soundkiss Star Date. And tonight we are here with Big Flo in the house. Hello, 안녕하세요. Okay, who is we? Your Big Flo. 안녕하세요, Big Flo. Yeah, look at this. The whole atmosphere is great. So please introduce yourself one by one. 한 분씩 저희 Soundk 청취자들께 인사 해주세요. Yeah. Yeah. 네 안녕하세요 저는 빅플로에서 랩과 안무를 맡고 있는 지욱 K 지욱인데 빌드인 지욱입니다. 네 안녕하세요 빅플로에서 보컬을 맡고 있는 유성입니다. 반갑습니다. 네 안녕하세요 저는 빅플로의 보컬과 예, 기럭지와 비주얼을 맡고 있는 논입니다. 반갑습니다. 네 안녕하세요 저는 빅플로의 막내 카리스마 래퍼를 담당하고 있는 하이탑이라고 합니다. 반갑습니다. Hello everyone. I'm leader and producer of Big Flow, Jonggyun. Hey, Jonggyun, are you from the states? 미국에서 오셨어요? No. No. <laughs> no. Benny Yu Chan. But I heard one of the members from the states. 한 분이 그래도 유학생활을 하신 걸로 알고 있는데, who is it? Ryan Long. It's me. Ryan. Oh, why don't you introduce yourself in English, please? Hey, uh, what's up? My name is Ron, and、yeah. I'm singer. And <laughs> visual in. <laughs> oh, you're the visual. Yeah, visual. Uh huh. A、mm, member. In member. Yeah. I see. <laughs> Thank you. Nice one. Ah, 정규 씨가 더 잘하시네요. 죄송합니다. And I'm just kidding.、Yeah. All right. Before we start our interview, we have pop quiz going on, and of course, we'll randomly choose the winner and give away the signed CD of Big、wow. Flow. So a lot of participation. And tonight's pop quiz, Big Flow's pop quiz, is what is. Is the name of Big Flo's title track?、Oh, yeah. If you know the name of the title track, please post it up on our message board. It's arirangradio.com/soundk. All right. So, wow, Big Flo, it is. When did you guys debut? 언제 데뷔하셨죠? 얼마 안 되셨어요, 그죠? 네, um, 저희 6월에 올해 6월에 데뷔한 uh-huh. 네 하이탑. 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 미 말하겠습니다. <웃음> <웃음> 네, 저희 6월에. 네. 올해 6월에 데뷔한 따끈따끈한 신인 빅플로라고 합니다. Yes, yeah. they debuted、네. in June, and now it's winter already. 와 그래도 벌써 반 년이 지나셨네요. 네, 그렇죠. 어떠 어떠셨어요 이번 또한 달밖에 안 남았는데 it's only been it's the last month of 2014. 음. Are you guys busy? 요즘에 굉장히 바쁘시죠? 어 지우기입니다. 네, 지우. 네. 어 저희가 지금 그래도 음 일찍 활동이 끝나고 그래도 네. 일본에도 네, 저희 단독 콘서트를 다녀오고 또 상황이 또잘 끝나서 이번에 또 이번 26일, 12월 26일에 또한번더 가게 되었습니다. 네. 네. 그렇군요. 네. 26일날 또 얼마 안 남았네요. 네. 그럼 준비할 게 굉장히 많겠어요. 네. <웃음> okay, so Jiu was saying that、uh, after the first album, they, you know, they were very busy, and then they had a chance to hold a solo concert in Japan. 박수 한번 주세요. Because they gained a lot of popularity, and you know the feedbacks that they will, are able to、uh, do another show in Japan on, which is December twenty sixth, 26th, right? Once again for yes,、uh, in Japan. So、yeah. a lot. Please, please make sure to attend、uh, the concert that they have. That's amazing. 굉장히 좋으시겠어요. And I heard that Jonggyun. That you speak Japanese. Why don't you say something to your Japanese fan? Ah,、uh, can I say here? 
Yeah, you're t- speaking English right now. Oh, I'm speaking English right now. 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 One of the best rookie group in 2014 that have a fascinating and fantastic uh, and uh, the diverse uh, of uh, musical in a musical genre. Okay, I don't get that part. Okay, so uh, you guys are flawless. So I love your music. 자, 개인적으로 음악을 uh, 굉장히 좋아한다고 그리고 wow. 2014년에 최고의 신인 그룹일 것 같다고 oh. 인것 같다고 oh. 말씀해 주셨어요. And thank you very much. I am very, very proud of you. Yeah. 굉장히 본인이 자랑스럽다고 oh. 말씀해주셨습니다. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you Lele21 from Indonesia. And also, we have one from Tunisia. Tunisia에서도 왔어요. Yeah. Oh. Tunisia. Tunisia에서 빅블로 oh. 아시고 yeah. 계십니다. 저희 처음, 저희 처음인데, Tunisia. 아, 앞으로 조금 더 이제 깜짝 놀랄 일이 많으실 oh, 거예요. 네. We have a Hazar from Tunisia saying to Big Flow, Hello, I'm a very excited for today's show. 오늘 와주셔서 너무 감사드리고요. I think you guys are very lovely. And I want to say hello for all the members, especially our leader. Uh, Jung Kyun. 네, hi, yeah. uh, hi. 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 <laughs> There is a love confession. All right, let's move on to our next question. This is from Leon Tail93 from Singapore. Oh, 자, wow, Singapore. Singapore. 자, 질문이 있어요. Yeah. Well, first of all, hello, I'm a Leon from Singapore. Inside to say hello, Leon. Hello, hello, hello. Leon. Yeah. I just want to say I love you all and your, I love your song so, so much. 이번에 yeah. 타이틀곡 너무너무 좋으시다고 oh. 말씀해 주셨어요. Yeah. All right, so first of all, how do you all come together to form this member, this group? Mm. 자, 어떻게 해서 다 같이 이렇게 다섯 명이 모이게 됐는지 mm. 네, 좀 말씀을 좀 해주세요. Oh, 굉장히 길라면 길 얘기죠. 네, 짧게 우리가 또 정리를 좀 해주세요. 네. 누가 해주실까요? 네, 제가 그러면 짧게 한번 네. 해볼게요. 정기훈. 네, 제가 빅플로의 이제 첫 번째 멤버였어요. 야, 야. 예. 네, 그런데 이제 제가 대표님과 함께. 이제 같이 이제 힙합 그룹 멋진 힙합 그룹 만들 건데 hey, 멤버를 이제 캐스팅을 했어야 되는 상황이었어요. Oh. 그래서 같이 이제 오디, 오디션을 진행을 했고 네. 그래서 이제 뽑은 이제 친구들입니다. Oh. 네. 아 그러면 거의 거의 정균 씨가 같이 일하고 싶은 사람을 뽑은 거랑 마찬가지라고 볼수 있네요. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right, right, yeah. 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 Yes. No, 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 no. Alright, yeah. you know what? Uh, Jungkook was saying that he was the number one artist in that agency, their agency, <laughs> and they were, you know, the boss wanted to create, uh, pro, you know, produce this hip hop group. <laughs> hip hop. Hip hop. Yes. Thank you, High Top. Yeah. And you know what? Um, they held the audition. And Jonggyun was maybe one of the judge, yeah. and he was there, and he uh, actually picked all four of them, and then mm. they became uh, as a one group. Oh, okay, what a yeah. story! And one more question: uh, What are you all planning to do for Christmas? 자, uh-huh. <laughs> Christmas 가 다가오고 있습니다. Yeah. 자, 자, 그래요. 유정 씨, 네. 유정 씨한테 물어볼게요. 네. What are your plans for the Christmas? Christmas 때뭘 하고? 하... 하실 아, 건지 아, 네. 네 유성입니다. 어 일단 크리스마스 날이면 되게 기분 좋은 날이잖아요. 그렇죠. 그렇죠. 그래서 너무나도 하고 싶은 게 많아요. 솔직히 음. 오케이. 맛있는 것도 먹으러 가고 싶고 뭐 쇼핑도 하고 싶고 예. 뭐 한강 가서 유람선도 너무 타고 싶고 <웃음> 좀 낭만적인 걸 되게 좋아해서 혼자요? <웃음> 네 그렇네요. 여자 친구가 있으십니까? 아니 없어요. 감사합니다. 아, 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 크리스마스 날 좋아. 
어떠신가요? 갑자기 여기 빅블루는 사랑 고백하는 팀인가봐요. 그럼요. Okay, so Yu Song was saying that because it's Christmas, he wants to do a lot of things. He actually want to, you know, get on to the ferry or go shopping or he wants to eat delicious food. But the thing is, he's alone. He's alone. single right now, and he just literally asked me that if I can spend time with Yu Song. Yu Song 씨, 네. 알겠습니다. 아 정말요? 저희가 사실 이제 26일 날 일본 콘서트가 있어서 <웃음> 네. <웃음> 연습해야 돼요. <웃음> <웃음> 연습을 해야 될것 같아요. <웃음> so sad. <웃음> so sad. Jung Kyung was saying that. But you know what? On 26, we have a Japanese concert. Maybe we have to practice. Ah, Jung Kyung 씨는 일에 지금 굉장히 <웃음> 멀뚱히 하고 계신가 봐요. 아, 그렇습니다. 정규 씨도 보면은 그러면은 그러면 싱글이신가 봐요? 솔로신가 봐요? 아, 그렇죠. 그러니까 집중할 수 있는 거예요. <웃음> well, also, Jung Kyung is a singer. He is going to focus on his work. Okay, we have a very one from Turkey. Turkey. Oh, okay. Turkey. Turkey. So, uh, I love you guys. I want to ask, uh, how can you dance so great? 자, 여기에서 음. 댄스를 맡고 계시는 분 누구? 네. 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 자, 지욱 씨. 네. 어떻게 그렇게 춤을 잘 추시나요? 라고 어. 어떤 방법이 있는지. 방법이요? 네. 일단 제가, 지욱입니다. 네, 일단 제가 춤을 시작한 지 오래됐어요. 어? 어떤 네. 춤을 추셨죠? 저는 어, 일단 중학교 때, 중학교 3학년 때부터 네. 이제 어 비보이랑 오! 비보이 전문 크루에도 있었고 그리고 아. 뭐 강사 생활도 했었고 아, 그리고 네, 팝핀 뭐 힙합 이런 것도 했었고 뭐 얼반 뭐 학종 댄스 장르들을 다 그렇네요. 많이 해와서 네. 못할 어. 수가 없죠. <웃음> 못할 수가 없네요. 네. 그래서 이렇게 많이 레슨을 아니면 수업을 하시다 보면은 네. 어떤 팁을 많이 주시나요? 제가 팁을 줄 때요. 네. 제가 팁을 줄 때는 어 저는 일단 제가 나이가 어리잖아요. 그러다 네. 보니까 춤을 배운 지 얼마 안 됐기 때문에 제가 그 처음 선생님한테 배웠던 그 노하우들을 네. 제가 빨리 캐치했던 노하우들을 알려드려서 더 빨리 캐치할 수 있게끔 아 근데 그 노하, 노하우는 말씀 안 해주시네요. 네. 아 약간 좀 비밀 <웃음> 네. 기법 네. 같은 게 있나 봐요. 네. Okay, Jiuk is he's very mysterious right now. Okay, he was saying that he danced all kinds of genre. He danced since he was in the middle school and he does a hip hop, urban and also popping, just everything like a street dance and everything. He uh, actually uh, give uh, teaches uh, the you know students, and uh, he learned he learned a lot of things from his um, you know ex teacher, and now that know how with that know how he is, you know he's you know teaching mm. the the kids so with that his own know how. But the thing is, he's not sharing that know how. Mm, very mysterious. <laughs> 그리고, 그리고 제가 한 가지 더 말씀드릴 게 네, 있어요. one more thing. 제가 이때까지 정말 많은 분들을 춤을 알려드려봤어요. 네. 그런데 그 중에 제일 못 췄던 사람이 이 팀안에 있어요. <웃음> 아 정말요? <웃음> okay, so she was saying that he been teaching a lot, but uh, the worst dancer that he taught, the worst dancer, it's in this group. Yeah. Who is it? Uh, it's me. Ryan. 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 Yeah, it's Ryan. Yeah. Ryan. <웃음> 축하드려요. 아, 감사합니다. Congratulations. Yes, congratulations. Yeah. Man. What was the hardest, uh, hardest part? 뭐가 가장 힘드셨나요? 그렇게 힘드셨나요? <웃음> <웃음> 우시지 마시고요. 어떻게, 뭐가 그렇게 힘드셨어요? Um, 일단 몸이 잘안 따라주더라고요. <웃음> 말을 안 들어. <웃음> 몸이 말을 안 들어. 네, 몸이 말을 안 듣고요. <웃음> 네. <웃음> 몸이 굳은 건지. <웃음> <웃음> 굳은 걸까요? 네. I see. So yeah. Rome was saying that yeah. his body is not listening to his brain. Yeah. You know, he is very enthusiastic about it, enthusiastic about it. But I can see that it's just his body, right? Ah, uh, 그냥 몸이 그러신 거죠. 네, 그렇죠. 네, 아, 그러니까 네, 여, 열심히 네, 열심히, 열심히 하겠습니다. 노력을 네. 하시길 바라겠습니다. 네. Yeah. Yeah. All right. So, um, it is our time to listen to one of their track, and this track is also the answer to today's pop quiz. Actually, you have 2014 in uh, from the states. 자, 미국에서 어, 좀 이번에 타이틀곡에 대해서 좀 설명을 해주세요라고 yeah. 어, 얘기를 해주셨 해주셨어요. Can you yeah. explain why? Uh, about this title track. 누가 말씀해 주시고? 네. Hi Top. Hi Top. Yeah, Hi Top say. Okay. <웃음> 어. 한국어로 해 주세요. <웃음> 네. 저도 그래도 저도 유그 어학 연수 다녀왔어요. 아, 네. oh, okay. Okay. So why don't you introduce 근데, this? 네. 이걸 아 이걸까 이걸까 들으셔야 되는데. 네. 네. 
싱가포르였나요? 아, 아니 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 필리핀인가요? 제 필리핀에서 필리핀에 필리핀 이주인가? 아두달두 달. 아두 달. 아, 어두 달. 오케이. I mean, 네. why not? If you want to speak English, you can do that. Oh, 영어를 so... 하시고 싶으시면. Sorry. 아, sorry. <웃음> 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 okay. 네. 이번 곡에 대해서 네. 약간만 네. 설명을 네. 해주세요. 이번 곡 이제 타이틀 곡 제목 굉장히 특이하죠. 네. Bad Mama Jama. 네. Bad Mama Jama. Bad Mama Jama. Bad Mama Jama. 네. 그 뜻은 정말 치명적인. 매력을 가진 네. 아름다운 여성을 뜻하는 그런 제목입니다. 오케이. Okay. 어, 우리 스파니 누나 같은. 갑자기. 훅 들어오네요. 오케이, thank you very much. So yes, h i t a was saying that this is the song about a girl who is sexy enough to captivate everyone she meets. All right, so it is our time to listen to this track and continue our interview. This is Bad Mama j a m a by Big Flow. Here we go. Whew. Woohoo! Welcome back, everyone. You're listening to Sound K, and I'm your DJ Stephanie. That was Bad Mama Jama by Big Flow. Yeah. Wow! And also the answer to today's pop quiz, so you can participate easily. Of course, we randomly choose the winner and give away the signed CD of Big Flow. So once more, tonight's pop quiz was: What is the name of Big Flow's title track? You guys literally just heard that song. So a lot of participation. All right. Okay, so let's talk about this song. Mm, we were talking about sexy ladies. Ah, right? Right. So have you guys experienced that when you just see this, you know, gorgeous, sexy girl? Do you guys normally approach first or wait? Ah, 아름다운 여성을 보면요. 아 먼저 접근을 하시는 편이십니까? 아니면 좀 기다리십니까? 여기에서 약간 조금 사랑에 강하신 분. 네한 분만 말씀해 주세요. 서로 눈치 보고 있는데요. 강하면은 하이탑이죠. Really? Hightop? Are you a playboy? Yes. Uh, yes. 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 삼초간 저를 눈을 뚫어지게 쳐다보는 여자가 있고 아. 눈을 피하는 여자가 있어요. 음. 뚫어지게 쳐다보면 저는 더 이상 접근 안 하고 눈을 아. 피하면 저는 다시 접근을 하죠. 아, 아. 아. 그때 음. 딱 읽는군요. 아, 네. 이 여자 나한테 지겠구나. 네. 아. 그때 딱 잡는 거군요. Yes. 아니, 막내가 이러면 <웃음> 큰일 나는데. 아, 조심하셔야 되겠어요. <웃음> 네, so, h i t a was saying that he approached first and then he just goes up to her and then see, make eye contact for three seconds. Straight and see how she reacts. So if she doesn't look uh, him back, then he will just approach again. But whoever you know stares at him, you know with him, then he doesn't go you know farther than that. Why? Why? Mm. 그렇게 <laughs> 네. 눈을 먼저 피하시는 분한테 네. 그렇게 관심을 가지세요? 어, 저는 뭐 제가 생각하기에 네. 저는 굉장히 기가 세다고 생각해요. 아 제가 평소에 제 성격 기가 세다 생각하는데 저랑 3초가 이렇게 눈을 마주쳤는데 3초가 이렇게 피하지 않는다. 그럼 그분은 정말 기가 <웃음> 세신 여성분이거든요. Okay, so h i t a was explain that uh, uh, he thinks like he has this like some kind of energy like aura, but when the girls just energy. look at him, uh -huh, stare at him back, then that means like she's a stronger. Yeah. So he doesn't want to approach that girl anymore. We have a nice message plus the question from Asia 96 from Bulgaria. Bulgaria. Oh, yes, wow. so. Hello, hello, big flow. Hello. I am happy to see you guys. Mm. And this is my question: What do you think of dating with the foreigners? Hey, wait, 외국인을 사귀는 거에 대해서 어떻게 oh. 생각하시는지요? <웃음> 자, 아니요, 이거는요. 이거는 제가 좀 조용히 어, 계셨던 유성 씨한테 네. 좀 물어보고 싶어요. 저는 음, 솔직히 말하면 한 번도 생각 아 유성입니다. 예. Yeah. 네, 저는 솔직히 말하면 한 번도 생각을 해본 적은 없지만. 아, 그래요? 근데 어 제가 또 한국어 말고 또 네. 중국어를 또할줄 알다 보니까 아 만약에 중국 분이면 
어, 만날 수 있지 않을까? 아까. 아, <웃음> okay. So Yusong was saying that um, because he, he speaks Chinese and uh, you know, international, he never th- uh, thought about that, but maybe if it's Chinese, then he will probably, you know, possibly date that girl. So Yusong, 만약에 네. 이 여자가 마음에 듭니다. 그럼 가서 뭐라고 말하실 건지 중국어로 좀 아, 말씀을 해 주세요. Yeah. If you like this girl and you want to approach her, then w- what were you going to say in Chinese? Go ahead. 음. 아, 이런 것도 처음이에요. 아, <웃음> 아니, 왜 이렇게 갑자기 했네. 어. 我刚看到你非常漂亮了,所以我爱你. 어. 여기도 갑자기 사랑 고백하셨어요. <웃음> 네, 네, 네. I just love his voice. 네. Okay, thank you very much. We have a Sierra 988 from the USA. 자, 미국에서 보내셨네요. So, who does the most prank uh, in the group? 자, 여기서 가장 장난을 많이 치는 멤버가 누가 있을까요? Hi, Tom. Hi, Tom. Hi, Tom. Hi, Tom. Hi, Tom. It's me. Yes. yes. Uh, 어, 그러면은 누가 에피소드 있는지 좀 짧게 좀 말씀해 주시겠어요? 아 근데 이참 이참 애매한 게 네. 장난은 다 치는 것 같아요. 네, 네 맞아요. 진짜 다 쳐요. 아 그래요? 네. Oh, they make jokes and you know play. It's very playful of uh, everyone. Yeah. But it's not only Tai Top, but you know he is the you know that the main you know character who pranks. About everything. Yeah. Okay. Yes. We have a TV squad 91 from Romania. So, Romania is a Romania. So, I have a question. Which member is the most generous and treats the other members often? So, I have a question. Which member is the most generous and treats the other members often? So, I have a question. Which member is the most generous 네, 감사합니다. 없나요? 아, 아, 누구세요? 어, 론? 아, 아, 론, 론, 네, 론, 론, 우리 론, 네. 론 군이 네. 참그 성격이 기복이 없어요. 맞아요, 아~ 맞아요. 네. 네. 그러니까 항상 이렇게 그좀 약간 어떻게 보면 되게 무던하다 그러죠, 한국말로. 아, 네. 그렇군요. 약간 좀 아빠 스타일이시네요. 예스, yes. 그치. Yeah? 아빠보다는 아, 아. 약간 동생들한테는 약간 동네 바보 형 같은 <웃음> 음, 바보 형. 네. 아 무슨 그만, 뜻인지 알겠어요. 그만큼 되게 착하고 네. 네. 다 해줘요 아, 모든 사람들한테. 그런 것 같아요. Okay, so Jung Kyung was saying that definitely wrong because he is he's like a you know um father in this group, but uh, when he hangs out with the younger people, he becomes like very like foolish. So he's just too nice, way too, way too nice. Ron, do you agree with that? 본인도 그렇게 인정하시나요? Yeah. 네. Yeah. 그, 그, <웃음> 난 내가 제일 여기서 착하다. 네. 아. 아 근데 저희 그룹이 네. 구체적으로 예, 다 이제 착한 편이에요. 갑자기 포장을 <웃음> 하시나요? <웃음> 알겠습니다. 네. Ron was adding that everyone is so so generous and nice in this group. Really? Okay, moving on to Amanda Cooks from Malaysia. 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 Who is the passionist, fashionista in oh. this group? Oh, oh. oh. <laughs> 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 I can't tell you. What's the dress? I'm going to count down and okay. then why don't you guys just you know, point at this, that person, okay? okay. 자, one, two, two three. three. <웃음> 아, 한 몰린 경우가 패, 많이 없네요. 패셔니스타가 누군지. 아... 패셔니스타가 누군지 없나 봐요. 근데 대체적으로 네. 다들 좀 각자 개성에 맞게 네. 잘 입고 다녀요. 아, 네. well, Ron and Haita was pointing at, you know, Ron was pointing at himself and Haita was pointing at Ron. Uh, but Yu Song didn't point at anyone and Chiu was like he was hesitating. <웃음> and Chongyu Shin 누구 뽑으셨죠? 저는 저를 뽑았네요. 아, 정균 <웃음> picked oh. himself too. But 맞아요. 정균 added that um, everyone is fashionista. You know, everyone has yeah, a different everyone. taste. Yeah, everyone is fashionista. Yeah. Yes, everyone. Nice. And we have uh, Jennifer from the States. 자, 미국에서 왔네요. States. 자, if you could spend one day doing anything you want, what would you want to do uh, to have fun or relax? 자, 하루에 이제 휴가. 네. 가 있어요. 그러면 무엇을 가장 하고 싶으신지 아... 말씀을 좀 해주세요. 라고 해... 오셨네요. 정균 세이. 정균 세이. 네. I just wanna sleep. Oh, you just wanna oh. sleep. Yeah. yeah. 진짜로. I'm so tired every day. Oh. Yeah. 얼마나 요즘에 주무세요? So how long do you? Uh, four hours. Four hours maximum. Yeah. 
Wow. Maximum Everyone. five hours. Maximum five hours. Yeah. That's crazy. Oh my goodness. <laughs> you saw, uh, 네. you're not falling asleep right now, right? Uh, 지금 주무시는 거 아니에요? 제가 지금 오해를 좀 풀어야 되는 게 지금 제가 지금 여기 쌍꺼풀이 좀 잘못돼가지고 눈이 굉장히 불편해요, 사실. 쌍꺼풀이 잘못됐다는 말은 아니, 그게, 그게, 아, 그게 그 말이 아니야. 쌍꺼풀이 잘못됐어요. 아, 아니, 아니. 눈이 부어서. 네, 그러니까 눈 부어가지고 한쪽이 이렇게 그 약간 짝지게 되는데 있잖아요. 아, 네. 그걸 짝지게 되니까 눈이 자꾸 이렇게 뭐 불편한 거야, 한쪽이. 아, 네. 그래서 지금 눈을 이렇게 똑바로 못 뜨겠는 거예요. 이게 뭐 뭔가 균형이 안 맞아서. 아, 그래서 제가 일부러 이렇게 눈이 약간 이렇게 하고 있는데. 어. 졸린 것처럼. 네, 약간 이렇게 졸리신 줄 알았는데. 네. 아, 그런 깊은 뜻이 있어. 네, 절대 뭐 수술하고 이런 건 아닙니다. 아, 깜짝 놀랐어요. So first of all, you saw was saying that oh, I have a problem with my eyelid. So you know, I thought that he was having like you know the eyelid surgery, plastic surgery or something like that. But it's not that. It's just um his eyes a little swollen, so he has this lazy eyes right now. Okay. Anyway, yeah. thank you very much for answering that. But you know what? It is our time to listen to one of your song. You prepare for a Us. It's a live, right? 네. 이번에 라이브 네. 한곡 준비하셨는데요. 네. 어떤 곡인지 간단하게 설명해 주시고 네, 라이브 청해 듣겠습니다. 네, 정규? 저희 두번 정균이가 말합니다. 네, 말합니다. <웃음> 네, 저희 두 번째 이제 세컨드 플로우 앨범에 수록된 네. 가끔이라는 곡인데요. 네, 네 작사 <웃음> 하이탑 지우군이 했고요. 와 네, 작곡 저와 이제 하이탑 군이 했고 yeah. 편곡도 제가 했습니다. 음 네, 저희에게 아주 소중한 곡이니까요. 한번 네, 깊게. <laughs> All right, so amazing because they uh, actually wrote this song. Um, High Top and Jung Kyun wrote the song, and High Top came up with the lyrics. And this is one of the track in their album. So it is our time to listen to this track live. 준비되셨나요? Yeah. All right, this is Kakam Sometimes by Big Flow featuring Uyi Kyun live. Woo! Yeah. Ooh, yes, Ooh. very sexy song. Welcome oh. back, everyone. That was Kakum Sometimes by Big Flo featuring Uigyeon live. Ooh. Thank you so much. Yeah. 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 All right, so amazing, amazing. So I'm surprised with their skills and their amazing vocalists. Okay, so once more about tonight's pop quiz. We have a pop quiz going on. And of course, we'll randomly choose the winner and give away the signed CD of Big Flow. And tonight's pop quiz was, what is the name of Big Flow's title track? Yes, yeah. so please post it up on our message board. All right, so. Let's move on to our listeners' question again. 계속해서 지금 생방송으로 네. 메시지가 네. 도착을 하고 있습니다. 좀 인기를 실감하시나요 요즘에? Do you guys feel this popularity? 음. 어떻게? 아. 예. 사실 아직 한국에서는 좀 데뷔한 지 얼마 안된 신인이잖아요. 네. 그래서 크게 사실 실감하는 건 없었었는데 네. 저희가 그 얼마 전에 그 말레이시아에서 음. 가장 이제 말레이시아에 가장 와주었으면 하는 이제 신인 보이 그룹들 중에서 그 많은 분들을 제치고 1위를 했더라고요. 네. 많은 분들을 제치고 네. 그게 중요하죠. 네. 그죠. 네. 네. 좀 굉장히 유명하신 이미 유명하신 신인 분도 계셨고 좀 많은 분들 계셨는데 정말 감사하게도 빅플로가. 네. Yeah. yeah. Oh, 굉장히 축하할 일이네요. Okay, so Jung Kyung was saying that even their rookies, they didn't really feel the popularity, but I'm sure they will do feel that from now on because our listeners are supporting our guest Big Flow today. And also in Malaysia, they were having this, you know, survey that the inside of, you know, the rookie groups that which of the group that they want to invite to Malaysia most, and it was Big Flow. Yeah. Ah, 그리고 yeah, oh, 우리 and, 또 네. 아리랑 라디오에 나왔으니까 하나 더 뭔가 말씀드리고 싶은 게 하나 있어요. 네, one more 네. thing. 예, yeah, one more thing. Uh -huh. yeah. 뭐가 있죠? 그 이제 인도네시아에서도 지금 신인 그 투표를 하고 있거든요. Uh -huh. 네. 어. 저희가 지금 1, 2위를 지금 왔다 갔다 하고 있어요. 아, 어. 그럼 힘을 좀. <웃음> 네, 지금 <웃음> 네. 오늘 but. 오늘 청취자분들 저희 빅플로 오늘 방송 끝나면은. Uh -huh. 네. Okay, so there's a survey going on. Make sure to vote, especially in Indonesia, because um, now they're fighting, competing with other group, uh, you know, for the first place. So make sure to vote for Big Flow. Indonesia it is. Yeah! yeah. All right. Thank you so much.
<웃음> Thank you very much. And we have Merv from Turkey. 자, 터키에서 왔네요. 네. 자, Hello Stephanie and Big Flo. I'm your Turkish fan. 자, 터키에 살고 있는 팬입니다. I'm 18 years old. And 네. uh, do you know that you have a Turkish fan? 자, 터키에도 팬이 있다는 거 알고 계셨는지? 어, 네, 알고 있었습니다. Oh, so they actually knew about it. 정경 was saying that. And my favorite member is... 지우. Yeah. 지우가 oh. 개인적으로 너무 Thank 좋아하시는데요. You. Uh. Because you're so cute and handsome. Yeah, I know. 아니, 지금 선글라스 끼고 계시는데 저 선글라스 좀 벗고 한번 눈좀 보여주세요. So why don't you take off your sunglasses? <웃음> <웃음> 제가, 제가 원래 어, 좀 얼굴이 잘 붙는 편이에요. <웃음> 아, 지금 두분다 네, 부으셔가지고 네. 이러시는 거니까? 부은 사람만 이쪽에 앉아요. 네. 네. 아, 그렇군요. 그래서... 상태 좋으신 분은 여기 계시고. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, okay, so uh, um, Jiu was saying that uh, the reason why he put the sunglasses on because his face, whole face is swollen right now. So um, I'm so sorry about that. But anyway, so Jiu, this is for you. What is your ideal type? 자, 이상형이 어떻게 되세요? 어, 저는 어, 웃는 게 정말 이쁜 사람을 좋아하고요. Girl with a pretty smile. 그리고 어, 어른들한테 되게 잘하는 사람을 좋아하고 mm. 예의 바른 사람. Who's very polite for all the seniors, the elder um, people. Oh, I see. 아, 굉장히 그런 분들은 굉장히 많으실 것 같은데. <웃음> <웃음> 모든 사람이 다 이상형이 됐네요. <웃음> okay. Thank you very much. And we have Lynn from Singapore. 자, 싱가포르에서도 왔는데요. 자, 싱가포르 팬들께 인사 한번 해주세요. 누가 대표로 해주시겠어요? 우리 유성군이. Yes, 네. 유성. 싱가포르 이름을 어떻게 싱가포르어로 해야 되나요? 아니못 <웃음> 하시잖아요. 아이, 컴온. 너도 싱가포르 땡큐. 아, 짧게 해주세요. I love you, Singapore. <웃음> yeah, I love you, Singapore. <웃음> 아니, 계속 이 문제 사랑, <웃음> 사랑에 목이 많으신 것 같아요. <웃음> oh, lonely, Seems lonely. like, lonely. yes, they are very lonely. So everyone was, you know, uh, confessing. That was a big, big confession. Yes. Yeah, thank you very much, Yusong. Yusong, she comes on with that. And we have uh, Nadira from Malaysia oh. saying, Hello, big bro. Uh, Ron, I love you. Oh. <웃음> And can you please say Najira 사랑해 한국어로 해주세요 한국어 한국어로요? 네. 아 정말 사랑합니다. 이, 어, 이름을 말씀해 주세요. 아, 나지 아 나나나지라요? <웃음> <웃음> 나지라 <웃음> 사랑해요. 사랑합니다. Oh, thank you, you so very much. much. Oh, yeah. And we have Munsera from Indonesia. Oh, oh, Indonesia it is. I see. Hello, Big Flo. Um, I want to say hello to Hi Top. Hi Top. Hi oh, Top. This is rap. for you. I really, really love your uh rap when you rap. Oh, ah, wow. you're my bias. 본인이 가장 좋아하는 멤버입니다. Yeah. Okay, so here's a question for you. If you have to choose cleaning your dorm and cooking for all the members for one week versus kissing and hugging Yu Song's cute hamster, which mm -hmm. one of which one that you will choose? 자, 둘 중에 하나를 고르셔야 돼요. Yeah. 일주일간 멤버들을 위해서 청소, 빨래, 요리까지 하셔야 돼요. <laughs> 아니면 유성 씨의 햄스터를 yeah. 매일 어, 뽀뽀를 해주시고 <웃음> 아, 안아주셔야 되고 이게 모든 걸다 하셔야 돼요. <웃음> 자, 둘 중에 하나를 진짜, 뽑아주세요. 진짜 어려운 어려운데 <웃음> just difficult. Difficult, yes. Oh. Oh. 하나, <웃음> 둘, 셋. Hamster. <웃음> Thank you very much. Oh my gosh, that was a really, really random question, but thank you very much. Ah, 그렇죠. 요리하시고 이렇게 일주일간 살림하는 것보다는 낫죠. And Shella from Indonesia saying, uh, 자, hi top, uh, 셀라노라 사 사야 친타카무. Okay. 자, 이 지금 한국어로 써 주셔 한국어로 써 주셨는데 네. 이거를 지금 네. 부탁을 하셨어요. 읽어 달라고. 아, 저게 사랑합니다. 네, 이거. 사랑합니다. 아. 네. How do you know that? It literally 아. means 사랑합니다. I, I love you. There you go. Hi top. 아, 셀라 누나. 어. 사야 친타 까무. 친타 까무. Uh, I love you. Yeah. Oh, there you go. Thank you very much. Okay. Thank you. Uh, we have a Valentina from Romania saying, "Which singer did you respect and admire before your debut?" 자 데뷔하시기 mm -hmm. 전에 롤 모델이 누구셨어요?라고 데뷔 시기 한 분만 말씀해 주세요. 자 지우. 네. 어저 같은 경우에는 어 박지영 선배님이랑. Oh, Jay Park. 그다음에 태양 선배님. Oh, oh Taeyang. I 네. can see why. 네. 그런 uh -huh. 스타일의 이제. 얼반 
분위기에 그런 것들 네 좋아하기 yeah. 때문에 네. He just yeah loves the sound like an urban style and a hip hop style and Taeyang and J Park definitely they uh, were the role model of Tukes. Thank you and we have Ozma for from Algeria. 자 알제리에서도 왔네요. 알제리. So what's your goal before the end of 2014? 자 우리 빅플로 음. 예 목표 2014년 얼마 남지 않았지만 아, 예 지금 현재에 가까운 목표가 있다면 뭐가 있을까요? 네, 일단은 저희 이제 2집 앨범이 나온 지 얼마 안 됐으니까 네. 네, 일단 2집 활동을 일단 최선을 다해서 할 거고요. 네. 네, 그리고 또 이제 한 해가 가기 전에 있는 이제 콘서트, 네, 네 일본 콘서트가 남아 있는데 음흠. 그것도 정말 성공적으로 잘 마칠 수 있도록 열심히 하도록 하겠습니다. Yes, yes. so j u n g k i n was saying that they literally recently released a new song and they will continuously uh, do uh, sing and perform for the audiences. And you know what? The concert is coming also, so they will put a lot of effort to it. Amanda Cook from Malaysia was saying that 제 생일이 12월 28일인데 미리 oh. 축하해 주세요. Oh. Please. Say happy birthday to uh, Amanda Cook. So happy birthday! Happy birthday! Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. <laughs> yes, and Chelsea from UK saying, My name is Chelsea. I have been a fan since the debut. I really love your song. Thank wow. you very much for your support. Uh, UK, 영국에서도 oh. supporter가 oh. 나타나셨습니다. Yeah. And uh, Chen from Israel saying, Fighting and my friends are your a big... Big fan of yours too. Thank you very much for sending in your message, Chen from the Israel. Israel. Oh. 네. Oh. 오늘 많은 사랑을 받고 가시는 것 같습니다. Oh. All right. I love you. All. It is our time to say goodbye to Big Flow. Oh. 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 벌써 저희가 며칠 시간이 됐는데요. 마지막 곡이죠. 자, 딜라일라 듣고 저희는 인사를 드리겠습니다. Oh. Yeah. 다음에 또 나와주세요. Yeah. 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 All right. So the last song that we are going to listen to is Dilaila by Big. Big flow and hopefully I can see you guys soon again. 감사합니다. Okay, always we are big flow. 감사합니다. 감사합니다.